today we are seeing something good, right? Mm -hmm. And it's been cold for some time. It's you know still chilly this morning, but it's a little bit warmer and we're going to continue seeing temperatures warm up as we head through the next couple of days. Look at this clear shot from Long Beach this morning. So we are seeing lots of sunshine in the forecast that's going to stick around as well. And for today, we're off to a bit of a warmer start, still chilly to start your day off, but temperatures are in the 50s already this morning as opposed to those 40s and 30s that we have been seeing. So certainly a little bit of a, a change there. If you're heading out of LAX today, one of the busiest travel days of the year, mostly sunny conditions expected. Certainly uh, no big problems in the weather department temperatures up into the upper 60s. However, if you're heading across the country, should be clear in San Francisco temperatures in the 50s, but Oklahoma City could be a problem dealing with freezing rain, dangerous conditions there, temperatures in the 30s. Down Dallas also dealing with some wet weather, ominous conditions there, temperatures in the 40s, and New York, partly cloudy conditions with highs in the 50s. We do have a frost advisory in effect for San Bernardino and Riverside counties. That'll continue in through the overnight hours. Temperatures close to freezing, but not quite as cool as they have been dropping below that freezing mark. We're going to continue to see that, though, for the next couple of mornings. Right now, temperatures warming up places like Los Angeles, Van Nuys into the 50s, still cool up in the high deserts into the 20s and 40s for Ontario. Today, we're going to see an afternoon high of about 68. So that's closer to that seasonal average of 69 degrees. We're getting close to that. Then we're going to start to warming above that. So we have a upper low that's really been just kind of sitting over the ba Great Basin area. That's contributing to these cooler temperatures. And that's going to push off to the east, and we're going to see a high pressure system building in. And by midweek, we'll see temperatures jumping up by about 10 degrees. And then on your Friday and your Saturday, we have a low pressure system dipping down. That could potentially bring us maybe a few showers up into the high country. For today, though, we're going to stay dry, keeping those temperatures for the most part into the 60s, 60 degrees for San Bernardino, 67 in Baldwin Park, and about 66 for Huntington Beach. Same for Santa Monica. Temperatures maybe a few degrees warmer than that in the valleys, but really not much difference from the valleys to the beaches today. Here's a look at your extended forecast. You can see a string of sunshine continuing as we head through the week. So temperatures today are going to stay into the 60s. We'll stay into the 60s for your Monday too. But by the time we hit about Tuesday, we'll start to notice those temperatures working their way up into the 70s. And we're going to continue with that warming trend. So Wednesday, we're going to see your highs climbing into the mid to upper 70s. So look at the valley locations really closing in on the 80 degree mark. So certainly a different picture as we head towards about midweek. For your Thursday and Friday, things start to change a little bit. We'll see a little bit more in the way of cooler weather and then clear conditions for your Saturday. Up and through the Inland Empire, temperatures warming from the 60s to the 70s. And then we do have a chance of maybe picking up a few raindrops on your Friday, drying out on Saturday. High desert bringing us clear conditions, temperatures into the 50s, warming to the 60s. And then for the mountains, we're going to actually stay pretty cool once again today up and through the high country with highs topping out really only in the 30s. Then as we head into your Monday, Temperatures will warm in the 40s, 50s for midweek. And then we do have a slight chance of maybe picking up a little bit of wet weather for your Friday. Windy conditions also expected by the end of the work week. And then we're clearing out by your Saturday.